And you, and you knew to try to pick it up enough to fall on it and all that. Well, I, I ran back there fast enough that I knew I had some time. I mean, not much, but I knew I had, had some time. So as soon as I picked it up, I kind of just looked, turned my head to see where those guys were. And I just had a little bit enough, enough space to try to extend the play. How did the cold affect the throw? I missed a couple throws. Um, you know, I, I missed one early. I, I, I think that uh, to, to, um, to to Fred Jackson. I, 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 I feel like I never missed that throw. So that, that was a little off. Other than that, it wasn't bad, honestly. Uh, the deep balls were a little bit tougher. I had one where I had Doug. You know, I was going to throw to Doug and I threw it extremely high. I got kind of. I think I got kind of bumped. I didn't. You know, I, I was going to be a touchdown. Um, but uh, you know, that happens. You know, so it wasn't a major factor. <coughs> Um, the hardest part was just communicate because it was so cold. Your mouth kept freezing, and, you know, and, and trying to communicate to those guys. So, um, but you know, it's no excuse. You got to find a way to win, and that's what we were able to do today. The defense kept hanging in there. We kept playing together. Uh, guys kept leaving on the sideline. That's what it takes, you know. And, and we've been here before. We've been in some tough situations, and and uh, showed up. You know, the experience showed up for us. And then, um, you know, fortunately, we were able to um, you know, get away with you know the guy missing the field goal, Blair. He, he, which he, you know, he's a great field goal kicker. So, um, you know, we we, we were. Well, we were fortunate to have that. Were there headset problems? Second. Headset problems? Early on there was, yeah. <coughs> you know, for some reason, you know, I couldn't hear the plays, you know. Um, but, uh, you know, we adjusted and tried to find a way to, to make something else happen. What's the protocol when that happens? Um, there's a couple times I just called the play. Um, just called a play, but, um, you know, just try, to, just try to think about the situations. And, and Bev hung in there with me. And um, we would hear bits and pieces of the play. So I just, you know, all the studying you do, you just... You hear, you hear the, the formation, and you hear the, you may hear the, the protection of the route or whatever it may be, and so you just put the two together. Is that when you guys had to, to call the timeout early? Yeah, I think there's a couple times we had to call timeouts on that. So, you know, I, I think we're just going to do a better job of keeping our tempo up, especially on the road. So it's always challenging and, and uh, in a tough environment, like I said. And, and uh, you know, I, I thought we battled, though. That, that's the exciting part, man. It's just how we battled. The, the, like I said, the middle fortitude that it takes to win in, in, in this type of environment. Um, we believed in one another. It's exciting. You know, anytime you win in the National Football League, it's a good win. Doug Baldwin said uh, that he doesn't believe in luck.